Forget the subway. When it comes to commuting around the city, New Yorkers are trading in their metro card for a bicycle. I think the main reason is that people are starting to realize it's a lot easier to get around on bicycles. According to a survey from the Department of Transportation, biking as a form of transit has been on the rise. Commuter biking has more than tripled in the past decade. Jason Gallacher, founder and owner of Affinity Cycles in Williamsburg, has seen the popularity of bicycles grow in the city. I think it's almost doubling year per year. And with DOT, their introduction of all the bicycle lanes, I think it's really, it's improved cycling and made it a lot safer. The DOT survey also recorded the number of cyclists riding across bridges in New York City. The Williamsburg Bridge had far more riders than any other bridge. It goes into sort of the dichotomy of the neighborhoods. So trendier, younger crowd neighborhoods such as Williamsburg or um, the Lower East Side or uh, Dumbo um, are going to see more cyclists than, you know, the more sort of suburban areas of Queens. Cycling is a way of life for Alfred Bobet Jr., who has been a professional cyclist and bike messenger for almost 20 years. Uh, also, it's kind of become like the latest trend as far as like fashion is concerned. Um, people were like the last couple of years have been going somewhat green, and I think utilizing a bicycle kind of justifies that to an extent. The future of biking in New York City is on a clear path to gain more followers with the launch of Bike Share in May. The uh, Bike Share program is going to kick you know, cycling into uh, just another stratosphere in terms of its popularity. And with spring just around the corner, even more cyclists will be gearing up to get on the road. In Williamsburg, I'm Tiffany Kamhai.